first uh, first year as head coach, how do you think it all went? Uh, it was a pretty good year, wasn't it? Uh, fell into a bit of a slump halfway through the year, but uh, I like the way the boys finished off the year. We certainly did a few things differently to the previous couple of years, but um, it's a start. We heard that you have been um, channeling a bit of Will Smith, Fresh Prince of Bel Air tonight. Uh, is, is that the look you were going for? Um, just something silky, to be honest, something smooth, not too trendy, but bringing the uh, bring uh, old school back, so old is gold there. Now, you've always been one for fashion. Uh, talk us through your, your get-up tonight. Oh, this is just something I found in the back of the closet, mate. So, yeah, nothing special, but just trying to match the, match the lady, man, you know, she's the star of the show. So, who are you both dressed by tonight? Um, I have no idea. Just recently, you know, you, um, you played for Australia again. How was that? You know, a long two years out. It's good to see you back out there. Thanks, mate. Yeah, it's, it's uh, great to be back out there. Um, it has been a long time. We really enjoyed the season with the Brums, and, and um, yeah, lucky enough to, to get a, get an opportunity. So hopefully, make the most of it. First year down here in Canberra, you know, um, how'd you enjoy it, mate? Oh, mate, I loved it. Um, yeah, loved every minute of it. Uh, very happy with how the team went during the year. Uh, just loved the, the bunch of blokes that we've got in the team, and yeah, no, it was great. Great first year of Super Rugby. I mean, you know starting position there and you know Wallabies honours you know how great you know your family must be very proud yeah uh, well, well the 50s they've, they're uh, come along so uh, yeah they're very proud so uh, yeah I was happy with the season what have you been up to in your leisure time obviously you've had a bit of time you know off in rehab we want to know what, what what's a Sam Carter get up to in his off time oh, mate not much not much at all uh, a lot of sitting on the couch watching TV but yeah, filling in time, not doing much at all. How's things in camera being, mate? How's the doc going? Talk us through it. First year, you won an award. You know, great. Yeah, mate, it's going well, going well. The, uh, all the female attendants are getting a bit of respite now that you're not there stalking them out, Scotty, and harassing our star, our female staff. But, uh, yeah, it's going well, mate. Uh, all the boys that are still here training hard, getting ready for Vikings. And, um, yeah, no, it's good. Everything's good. Uh, you had a few uh, extracurricular activities this year. Uh, you know, can you talk us through one of your favourites? Oh, a few extra extracurricular. Um. There were a few rumours floating around about a private jet. Oh, I'd like you to just confirm those rumours. Um. I'm trying to secure it for us for next year for a few trips, particularly in South Africa. That'd be good, I think. Yeah, you'd, you'd save a few backs and a few knees there. I don't know. There's a heaps to do around Canberra. Saw some platypus. Um, that was a highlight. First time I've ever seen a wild platypus. Some camping. Had my first ever stand-up paddle in the Lake Billy Griffin. That was cold. I see you out there, shirt off, tanning during summer. Obviously don't need a tan, as you can see. Uh, there's a rumour floating around that you already picked the award winners halfway through the year. Uh, you know, is there any truth to that rumour? Uh, pretty much, yeah. I think uh, everyone knows that uh, Christian Littlefano is uh, my favourite player and uh, I'll be surprised if he doesn't get the award tonight. There's a, there's a vicious rumour going around that um, Bernie told you halfway through the year you've already won best back. Uh, I just want you to confirm that confirm or, or deny these rumours? No, I've got it in my contract last time I signed that um, every every year I've got to win best back so I'm looking forward to, I already prepared my speech for best back so yeah, I'll just, I'll have to go through my saved documents to see which speech I'll use tonight but uh, no, 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 oh, man, I'm, I'm tipping there'll be some some surprises tonight. I think uh, Henry, oh that's probably not a surprise, Henry Spate um, had, a, had an awesome year, um, Robbie Coleman as well, Jesse Mogg, um, unfortunately he's not here but yeah, there's been some fantastic players in that back line. I don't think I'll, I'll, I'll win it, bro. The winner of the 2015 Best Back Award is Christian Liliofano. Whitey, uh, just recently you see you went to Chicago with the badge. Yeah. Uh, it is heard that you devoured a 23-layer chocolate cake. Um, how was it? You can talk us through it. I did, it was Michael Jordan's uh, restaurant and he had a 23 layer chocolate cake and uh, the whole table thought I was getting it to share but I devoured it myself, uh, you know I love my sweets so yeah it was good. Yeah, how good, always have to get it for yourself. Big big year again for you this year, first first try, you know how, how was that, how was that feeling? Well mate as good as uh, a long time coming, I mean it was like almost three years so yeah now nah, like I said before good to not have to do a, a nudie run this year. Nice, nice. I also heard that you've been um, smashing an app called My Fitness Pal. Uh, how, how's that been treating you, mate? Oh, mate, wait and see. Wait till summer, and then I'll show you the results. Yeah. Yeah, it was good. Um, I think, if anything, I really enjoyed this year with the boys. Uh, 
obviously playing behind this, this, this guy here. He's sponsored by Ron, Ron Bennett and Bradley. But yeah, no, if, if, if for anything, yeah, no, I just had fun and um, yeah, just very honoured to be part of the team. I also heard that you just re-signed for two years. How, how good, you know, obviously you're loving the Canberra weather. That's why you wanted to stay. But uh, yeah, no, uh, what was the thought process there, mate? Oh, mate, yeah, the weather was a, the main factor in deciding. But um, yeah, no, I'm really stoked to sign for another two years. Uh, as I said, I, I've enjoyed everything about it and hopefully, you know, the next couple of years we'll take out a title. And hopefully I'll do it with you, Scotty. Well, I have been told by a few of the Roars boys that you have the best hands in the team. Can you uh, confirm that, please? No, nah, mate, not me. I can't catch a ball to save myself. Um, no, nah, it's just fun playing with the boys, and uh, that's my local junior club, so it's, it's, it's really good to get back there and, um, and play for the Blue Baggers. You know, they're, they're a special group of boys, and um, I just love playing for them. We, we really appreciate the support you've given us this year. Um, you know, was there a favourite moment from this year? Oh, we were so proud to see you guys make the finals and um, I think that was a really proud moment for us for as, as in our first year, so very good job. Yeah, awesome. Well, once again, thank you for all the support and uh, you know, I hope we continue a healthy relationship over the next few years. Obviously you've been named in the Wallaby squad again for the next two weeks, so you know, huge honour, you must be very excited. Yeah, really excited to get into camp tomorrow, I can't wait to uh, hang out with the boys and you know, train hard to uh, you know, hopefully beat the All Blacks, so um, you know, that's the goal. Um, and that's what we'll be working towards and uh, yeah, looking forward to working with the boys and hopefully achieving our goal. Um, last year in the Brumbies colours, how, how was it How was it for you and uh, you know, moving on to France next year, are you looking forward to it? Yeah, I'm looking forward to it but it's also, uh, you know, I've enjoyed my time here and you know, tonight's a pretty emotional night, pretty sad times but um, hopefully it's just a, you know, just see you later, not a goodbye. You know, we've come um, leaps and bounds over the last sort of five, six years, and um, yeah, really, really uh, excited about the future as well. There's some um, great young talent coming through, and um, there's a title just around the corner, I feel, as well. Uh, individual awards in, in a team sport like rugby are a little bit un uncomfortable, but um, if there's one you want to get, it's one where you're, you're voted by your peers. You know, they're, they're the guys that you're spending um, you know, the, the pre-season and all the training and, and obviously the games with. Um, the guys that you consider family. And uh, I feel incredibly lucky to have spent the last three years with the Brumbies. Um, made some, some great friends and I really enjoyed it.